though I haven't did a, you know, like a health update with you guys in a while. Um, and I thought, but you know, no better than today to do it because I had an appointment yesterday with my rheumatologist. Um, and upon him, you know, I had um, put a lot of notes in my phone of, you know, things that I have been hurting or things that I've been dealing with within the past month from seeing him, you know, previously. And um, so they, what they did was they ran another lupus scan where they, um, well, I still have all the tape and stuff on my arm. They did another lupus scan yesterday, so they drew a lot of blood. And oh my god, was I so tired from after that. Like, I was so exhausted after that appointment. But I also was um, telling him about the bad hip pain that I've been having, too. So I was telling him about that, and he ordered an x ray, and I got an x ray done yesterday. And boy, am I feeling that x ray because they had me like turning my legs funky ways and holding it there. So my, my hips are really sore from that. Um, and then within like two hours after I got home from. Um, from my appointment, uh, my doctor called me and and it turns out that I have arthritis in both of my hips. So that's where the pain was coming from. So I never got told by my doctor that I had arthritis before. Um, so it was a shock. But um, I mean, I like I like I told Mark, I said, I don't know if it makes any sense, but I'm like relieved that I know why I'm having pain. But then again, I'm kind of like, you know, upset and stuff because of, you know, like people that I know who have arthritis and the pain that they're in and stuff like that on top of, you know, everything else that I have. So, um, you know, it's like I'm having mixed emotions about it. Um, so he called yesterday and, um, you know, he told me he was going to put in a referral for, um, a, you know, like an arthritis specialist and, um, you know, so that way they can... Uh, you know do some stuff to my hips and so I scheduled that appointment a little while ago and I go on July 16th so they can do something with my hips and um, I mean I'm a little bit worried because I'm afraid that my hips may hurt a little bit after whatever they're gonna do to it and I don't want to be hindered any more than I already am you know I don't want to be stuck using a cane or you know like a walker or a wheelchair you know so it's like you know I'm a little bit worried because I don't know exactly what they're gonna do um, so, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm kind of looking forward to that appointment because, you know, of possibly getting relief. But then again, I'm worried because I don't know what they're going to do. But, um, so, you know, I'm just waiting on that. And I'm also waiting on the results from my lupus screen, um, because they did one like a year ago and it had traces of it in my system. So they're seeing if it's more prevalent in my blood or if it's, you know, or if it's, you know, the same. So I'm waiting for those results. Um, so, you know, I'm a little bit, you know, still a little bit worried because of that. Um, because I don't know what the answer is, you know. So it's like out of my, out of my grasp, so to speak. So, <coughs> excuse me. So that's. So, um, so yeah, that's what I've just been dealing with today, and I'm kind of, like, really sore today, but it could have been from my appointment and all the tests that they did yesterday. So, um, and, uh, you know, like, so today I'm pretty much just gonna try to chill, you know, I have to, um, from my trips from Milwaukee, I have to go get that stuff out of my car still because it's still in my car, but, um, you know, I'm just going to try to, you know, just relax and, you know, everything's out of my hands, so I'm trying not to worry, um, but, you know still you know it's still there you know it's like it's hard to it's hard to not worry about it you know but I'm just trying to you know like occupy myself so I don't think about it so um, I just wanted to keep you guys updated with everything that's going on um, especially since you know like I went to the doctor yesterday so everything's you know fresh in my mind um, but um, yeah so I go in to like get a thorough thing of my hips looked at and um he did my doctor did say I had a quite a quite quite a bit of arthritis in both my hips so I have a you know a, a vast area in my hips that are you know that have arthritis so um and that kind of worried me too but like I noticed today like my left hip hurts a lot more than my right hip so um I think too you know we have stairs in our house so I think all of that is just like killing killing them you know 
and I think that's another reason why I'm so sore but um you know it's just all about taking my time don't rush you know I'm not trying to make it worse because the fact that the arthritis is in my hip I don't want to um have it be to the point where you know I am wheelchair bound or something like that or I have to walk with aids and I don't want that to happen so I just you know want to go about it do everything I need to do to help them and you know I'm, I'm still so young and I don't want to you know like I'm already dealing with a lot and I don't want to you know have stuff add to it um so as of right now officially I have fibromyalgia chronic pain syndrome IBS also known as irritable bowel syndrome um traces of lupus in my system and arthritis so um so yeah that's a handful of stuff you know that I'm dealing with but um hey you know, uh, God gives, you know, his strongest warriors, you know, a, a lot on their shoulders. So I just take it as, you know, he just sees me as being really strong. And, um, yeah, so I just, you know, not trying to learn to live with it, but at the same time learning to live with it, <laughs> if that makes any sense. But, um, but yeah, just want to keep you guys posted. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any questions, please leave them down in the comments. And if you're new to the channel, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. Sorry about my janky look. I am literally in my pajamas and I just pulled my hair back into a rubber band. Like, I just i'm just janky looking but i apologize <laughs> but anyways um thanks you guys so much for watching please give the video a thumbs up and share it to bring awareness to other individuals who may be dealing with the same thing that i'm dealing with so make sure you please share the video and i will see you guys later.